Hello, welcome to how to solve this exponential equation 9 to the power x plus 1 minus 9 to the power x minus 1 is equal to 20 and we need to find the value of x. First of all, we split this one, we split this one as this one as 2 minus 1 9 to the power x and we split this one as plus 2 minus 1 minus 9 to the power x minus 1 is equal to 20. Now, we change the position of this negative 1. We write this negative 1 with this x and this plus 2 after this. 9 to the power x minus 1 plus 2 minus 9 to the power x minus 1 is equal to 20. Now, according to property of exponents a to the power m plus n is equal to a to the power m times a to the power n. We can write this 9 to the power x minus 1 plus 2 as 9 to the power x minus 1 9 to the power x minus 1 times 9 to the power this 2 9 to the power 2 minus 9 to the power x minus 1 is equal to 20. Now, as you can see this 9 to the power x minus 1 is a common factor. So, we factor out this 9 to the power x minus 1. 9 to the power x minus 1 as a common factor times in bracket left 9 square minus 1 is equal to 20. Next, 9 to the power x minus 1 times this 9 square is equal to 81 minus this one is equal to 20. Next, 9 to the power x minus 1 times 81 minus 1 80 is equal to 20. Next, we divide both sides of this equation by 80 and this 80 will be cancelled with this 80 and uh, at the left side left 9 to the power x minus 1 is equal to and from here 21 time and 24 times 80. So, at the right side left 1 over 4. Now, according to property of exponents a to the power m minus n is equal to a to the power m divided by a to the power n. We can write this 9 to the power x minus 1 as 9 to the power x divided by 9 to the power 1 is equal to 1 over 4. Next, we multiply both sides of this equation by 9 and this 9 will be cancelled with this 9 and at the left side left 9 to the power x is equal to 1 over 4 times 9, 9 over 4. Now, from here we take log of both sides. Log of 9 to the power x is equal to log of 9 over 4. Now, according to log property, log of a to the power n is equal to n times log of a. This power x, this power x will come here. So, we write this as x times log of 9 is equal to and according to log property log of a over b is equal to log of a minus log of b. This log of 9 over 4 can be written as log of 9 minus log of 4 and we divide both sides of this equation by 
log of 9. Next, this log of 9 will be cancelled with this log of 9. And uh, at the left side, left x is equal to, we can write this uh, log of 9 minus log of 4 over log of 9 as log of 9 over log of 9 minus log of 4 over log of 9. Next, x is equal to this log of 9 will be cancelled with this log of 9 and here left 1. So, here we write 1 minus this log of 4 over log of 9. Log of 4 over log of 9. Next, x is equal to 1 minus, we can write this log of 4 as log of 2 to the power 2 divided by, and we can write this log of 9 as log of 3 to the power 2, and x is equal to 1 minus, according to log property, log of a to the power n is equal to n times log of a. You can write this log of 2 to the power 2 as 2 times log of 2 divided by and we can write this log of 3 to the power 2 as 2 times log of 3. Next, x is equal to 1 minus this 2 will be cancelled with this 2 and according to log property log of a over log of b is equal to log base b of a. We can write this log of 2 over log of 3 as log base 3 of 2. This is the value of x, this is the final answer. Now, let us verify this value of x by putting this value in the original equation. The original equation is 9 to the power x plus 1 minus 9 to the power x minus 1 is equal to 20. In this equation, we put the value of x 1 minus log base 3 of 2, 9 to the power the value of x is 1 minus log base 3 of 2 plus this one minus 9 to the power value of x is 1 minus log base 3 of 2 minus this one is equal to 20. Next, 9 to the power this one plus this one 2 minus this log base 3 of 2, log base 3 of 2 minus 9 to the power, this plus 1 will be cancelled with this minus 1. And here left negative log base 3 of 2 is equal to 20. Now, according to property of exponents a to the power m plus n is equal to a to the power m times a to the power n. We can write this uh, 9 to the power 2 minus log base 3 of 2 as 9 to the power 2 times 9 to the power negative log base 3 of 2 minus this 9 to the power negative log base 3 of 2 is equal to 20. Now, we can factor out 9 to the power negative log base 3 of 2 from here. 9 to the power negative log base 3 of 2 times in bracket left this 9 square, 9 square minus and 1 from here, 1 
is equal to 20. Now we can write this 9 as 3 square to the power this power minus log base 3 of 2 times 9 square is equal to 81 minus 1 is equal to 20. Now according to property of exponents this power 2 will be multiplied by this power negative log base 3 of 2. So here we write 3 to the power 2 times negative log base 3 of 2 is negative 2 times log base 3 of 2 times 81 minus 1 80 is equal to 20. Now according to log property n times log of a is equal to log of a to the power n. This negative 2 will become the power of this 2 3 to the power log base 3 of 2 to the power negative 2 times 80 is equal to 20. Now according to log property b to the power log base b of a is equal to a. This uh, 3 to the power log base 3 of 2 to the power negative 2 is equal to this 2 to the power negative 2. 2 to the power negative 2 times 80 is equal to 20. And according to property of exponents a to the power negative n is equal to 1 over a to the power n. This 2 to the power negative 2 can be written as 1 over 2 to the power 2 times 80 is equal to 20 and 1 over 2 to the power 2 is 4 times 80 is equal to 20 and from here 4 1 time and 4 20 times 80. So here left 20 is equal to 20. From here you can see that left hand side is equal to the right hand side. So it is proved that the value of x 1 minus log base 3 of 2 is correct.